came to dance, 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 dance. Yeah. I hit the flow, cause that's my plans, 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 plans. Yeah. I'm wearing all my favorite brands, 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 brands. Yeah. Give me some space for both my hands, 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 hands. Yeah, yeah, cause it goes on and on and on. Touch it, DiRosario, and he's done it again! Dwayne DiRosario, deep into injury time. Surely that's the winner, and surely it's three points. Here are the lineups. Toronto FC, three changes from the team that won in Houston last weekend. Nick Garcia and Rivas Hiskanovic fill the fullback berths, while Jake Peterson starts on the right side of midfield. Captain Dwayne Di Rosario starts wide left, but expect him to drift infield and support strikers Mike on Santos and Chad Barrett. San Jose just one change from the team which beat Philadelphia last time out. Jamaican striker Ryan Johnson, last year's top scorer, is recalled in place of Joey Jertsen. So Chris Wondolowski, this year's top scorer, may drop in behind Johnson and Giovanni up top. Giovanni, first touch for the Brazilian, looking to come tight inside Garcia. And down goes Convey, it's a penalty in the second minute. And Convey's gone down from the challenge... I believe from Gargan, and it gives Chris Wondolowski the chance to give San Jose a flying start against Toronto FC. Fry got a hand to it, he couldn't keep it out. Wondolowski is in double figures for the season, and San Jose lead by a goal to nil. Now to Guzman, will he shoot? Further right to Peterson, watched by Ward. Inside, De Guzman leaves it to Di Rosario, but underneath it. Here's Peterson, two to aim for if he can keep it in. Over the top is Mike on Santos. Save from Bush, the Brazilian again. Watched by Leach. And he finds a way round. Hernandez, the header away. This time, McDonald. Still not away. Now it's outside. On that far side, it's Barrett. The ball across the goalkeeper is dangerous. It evaded the ball in the end. But it was a teasing ball across from Barrett. Well, it's a wonderful ball from Chad Barrett. It's very difficult to defend against. He whips this in behind. He's bending towards goal. All that needs is a toe. Just a slight redirection from Di Rosario. He just can't quite get there. Mike Consentos thought he was going to reach it first. Didn't continue his run. Brazilian or Convi. Either across or Giovanni will try and get it up and over the wall. Four men in that wall. It is Giovanni, goes new side, and it's needed the save. Needed the save by Fry. That's the ball you get. Great free kick from Giovanni over the wall, but a wonderful save from Stefan Fry, who's been outstanding for Toronto this season. Johnson, Convy again. Wondolowski's in, Wondolowski. Well, Wondolowski had a clear side of goal. But failed to test Stefan Fry. Over the first hour, it's hard to argue against this scoreline. San Jose's been the better team. De Guzman trying to get things going. Mister well for a free header. He's missed it. Well, Mister won't get a better chance between now and the end of the season. All he had to do was nod it into the corner. And he didn't even get it on frame. Mister steps inside Wondolowski. Di Rosario trying to chip in. Oh, quality. Pure quality from Dwayne Di Rosario. That's a lifeline for Toronto FC. Di Rosario made it look ridiculously simple. TFC are back in it. They trail San Jose by 
two goals for them. What's the injury, Sergio, here? He's calling for this ball all the time. He always wants to get on it because he knows he can put the ball in the back of the net. Just needs to be given the service. And when the ball finally does come to him, he takes one touch. It's in the back of the net. What a fantastic finish from Dwayne DiRosario. Meanwhile, Wondolowski wants his hat trick. He's got it. And no sooner have Toronto FC given themselves a lifeline than Wondolowski grabs it away and completes his personal glory. Hat trick for Wondolowski. And the game is probably over as a contest. Well, there's two sides to football. One is obviously scoring goals, and the other side is defending. And Toronto FC haven't done that well enough today. Ty Hart dives in, doesn't get there. Wondolowski gets the ball on the edge of the box and takes a deflection off Rivas Skanovic. Poor Stefan Fry in goal. Absolutely nothing he can do here. Three quarters of the way through the game. Toronto FC trail by two again. Di Rosario towards the back post. Just wide by Maicon Santos. Got a good side of it. Firm head up, but again wide of the upright. It's a nice ball for Barrett, takes it first time, hits it, just wide. Nice technique by Chad Barrett. All that was missing was the finish. Ruby White picks it up. Peterson was making the run. Barrett turns, shoots, goal. Mike on Santos. And with 11 minutes left. Maybe there is life in this game yet. White turns. Will he shoot? It's a great ball for Peterson. Jake Peterson. Oh, he's missed it. Oh, Jake Peterson. The goal was at his mercy. And he couldn't find the target. And that's the story of Toronto FC today. And perhaps their season overall. It'll come to Khan, who tries his luck straight down the throat of John Bush. As Mr. Scott blows his final whistle. And Nick Dasovich experiences defeat as an MLS coach for the first time.